Hi, you're watching Floyd Steinberg's YouTube channel. Sony Cake asked me if I wanted to review anything from their product catalog. So I chose this wireless microphone audio transmission system. Apart from being helpful in making YouTube videos, this could also come in handy for musicians. Let's take a look. So this transmitter set comes in a box promising optimized frequency response, long battery life and stable signal transmission. And we'll get into that soon. First let's take a look what's inside. Here's a carrying case and a one-page manual. The manual is written in Chinese and English and easy enough to understand. Inside the case we find the transmitter and the receiver, some 3.5mm audio cables and a USB-C charging cable and the wind protector. Let's take a look at the transmitters, but one important thing first. Here's the transmitter. On the front there's an on-off switch, on top there's a built-in microphone and a mute switch and on the side there's a 3.5mm audio input and on the back there's a clamp. The receiver looks quite similar but here we have a headphone jack on top, a loudness switch with reef settings and a high pass filter to avoid rumbling noises. And on the side there's a 3.5mm line out and on the back there's another clamp. By the way, the clamps are sized in such a way that they will fit into the flashlight adapter of your camera. Charging these took half an hour. Let's turn them on by holding the power on buttons for two seconds. The receiver and transmitter should already be paired. And here's a quick sound check. This is the level here I used previously. This is the built-in microphone of the Sonic Cake. And this is the microphone I used previously over the wireless transmission. So far, so good, but now let's use this in a way that wasn't intended. I'll connect various instruments to the transmitter's audio inject. First one is my Reface DX synthesizer keyboard here. Here's a pad sound, first picked up directly and then through the Sony Cake transmitter. Here's an electric piano sound. And here's the microphone sitting inside my acoustic guitar. One final test I was really looking forward to. Here's a PC stick running a sample modeling instrument. This is connected to an EWI wind controller and audio out is going into the Sonic Cake system. In theory, I should be able to put all of this into my pocket and play wirelessly with a relatively good audio quality. Finally, I was curious to see how this system deals with a frequency sweep. So I connected it to the audio out of my computer and the audio in of my Zoom R20 recorder. Here's the result.
As you can hear, the audio input jack seems to be very sensitive to distortion, especially in higher frequencies. Now the culprit here could be that I fed an amplified signal into a socket that already has its own amplifier, so let's try that again using the microphone. As I'm living next to a busy road, there was no way I could capture this without external noise, so sorry about that in advance. Yep, there was a lot of background noise here, as expected, especially in the end, but I think overall we can take away from this that the frequency range is as advertised, but when using this with an external sound source, you have to be very careful when setting the audio levels. Last but not least, I'll test the reach of this device. I'll set up my recorder in my room and then head downstairs with the microphone and record my piano. The distance is around 10 meters and through two walls. Let's see how the Sonic Cake will handle this. Conclusion. The Sonic QWM10 does everything I hoped it would do, and that is being a good wireless voice microphone. The build quality is good, the usability is good, and the features are adequate. Sound quality of voice recordings is good, and the distance covered by the transmitter is bigger than expected. When using instruments, which to be clear is outside the specifications of this set, you will face some limitations. Transmission is in mono only and recording higher frequencies will expose some pretty obvious aliasing. But that again is by design, because this microphone set was built for capturing your voice. And for that, it's doing its job pretty well. Yeah, and that's it for today. The Sonic QWM10, certainly good value for the money. And if you found this interesting and useful, please consider subscribing to my channel. And as always, thanks for watching and see you again very, very soon. Bye bye.